Hello everyone and welcome to episode 2 of SimCity. So if you remember when we lo left off in the last episode we had a lot of pro problems going on and with like the water which is kind of under control now though I would like to get more water as an option because I'm sure that we are going to have more people living here soon. But yeah, I actually did go ahead and get some cash into the in between episodes. So that way we could actually do stuff this episode. And first off, we have an upgrade at City Hall. So yay. Um, what should we... Why is that still there saying upgrade? Can I upgrade it again? Um, okay. Okay, so I'm not going to put an add-on in City Hall just yet. But what I am going to do, that I've been wanting to do for a long time but haven't had the cash, is delete this road. Um, yes, we'll replace that stuff later. And the reason why I want to... And I'm going to have to rebuild that. Oh, well. Uh, no, cancel for now. That's kind of expensive. The reason why I wanted to demo this is because I want to go ahead and replace this road with a road that simply goes underground like a tunnel. Like so. And that way we got a little bit more room in our city. So this road right here, basically we're going to connect up to it through this side and this side only and that way we got a little bit more room here to work with so yeah now i gotta figure out where the heck i'm gonna put some stuff but uh one thing is i did i did play around with like seeing where i could put the mayor's house and maybe the mayor's mansion eventually and up here is pretty cool but it won't fit the mayor's mansion when we get that and i got it turned off right now because i was just you know testing it out and it doesn't cost anything so it's like why not so this does cost something, but it would, it, it, I don't know. I'd like to get the mayor's mansion. Don't know where I'll put it, but yeah. So after some thinking, I got a plan for where we're going to put our utilities for now on. We're going to put them back here. So like our power plant, we're not going to go green. Like I said before, we are just going to go ahead and you want to, well, do I want to, hmm. I'm thinking if I want to use... Like, there's, there's uh, add-ons to this that, you know, produce less air pollution, but it's like it's at the edge of the map, so, yeah. There will be where our power plant will be, and since, let's see, global deliveries of coal, since we are not mining in this city. And in the future, we can go ahead and put more of these throughout here, and it will pollute quite a bit, but, you know, the wind goes that direction, so, who really cares? Okay, now one other thing is I'm thinking my sewage and water will probably go around here eventually But if we go ahead and look there's not really much water here at the moment So that means I'm gonna have to put it my sewage system there eventually But yeah Also along this road right here. I will say this road right here and sh should be replaced with a Avenue definitely because you know, it, it makes sense. We got an avenue over here. We should have an avenue over here for high traffic, you know, since this is what I'd probably consider one, like, the high traffic areas. So, yeah. I'm going to get to work on that. Okay, so after spending some time with fiddling around with these roads, I believe I have exactly where I want to put our town hall slash, yeah, town hall slash, um, what, what, what is it called when, when it's upgraded and so on? City Hall. Okay, so now, gotta put our Department of Utilities back in. Not enough simoleons. Oh, darn it. There we go. Now oh, I got enough simoleons. And we also are gonna need Department of Education. Oh, maybe I should give it... Well, you know what? It fits on this road right here. That's That's pretty much perfect. That's pretty cool, I guess. I mean, it would have been nice if it went on the avenue, but you know what? That works. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll rebuild this stuff again later. But yeah, now that we got that, we can go ahead and build ourselves a hike school because we got some education problems. Not approved. Um, I guess I gotta unpause the bit game for a second. Okay, I'm going to put some temporary water towers over here because 
literally this I, I don't want the city to be without water there we go okay we should be able to speed this all up and be fine for the most part we're gonna need a fire department back in here but let's see if we go to education yes it's now available okay pause the game so now we're going to want to put in the hike stool, and I'm wondering exactly how we're going to want to put it. Should we put it right in the middle? Should we put it more like here? I don't know. It kind of looks better in the middle. Hmm. Oh, decisions. Well, I think I'm going going to put it over here, but I, of course, I do not have the cash, so just take out another bond. Plop it down. And we need to upgrade this thing with another school bus. And we can literally only explore, afford one more school bus. So, yeah, I'm going to have to let the game run for a while in order to rack up some cash. But there we go. And i got to put back in our fire department and our clinic eventually. I don't know where I want to put them. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, you know, I, I'm thinking I might make this road do a little bit of curving over here and put the clinic and, and uh... And fire department and police station over here, maybe. Because I'm thinking that might help balance out the traffic for in the future. But yeah. I really do like this road right here. You, you know what? We could probably do something weird with this. Turn back on guides. I had them off for a bit. Oh, yeah. That looks pretty cool. That looks a lot better. Though, so if we actually upgrade this... <laughs> what the... That looks so dirt because this is such a small bridge. <laughs> you know what? I'm keeping it for now. I'm keeping that for now. <laughs> Quite a suspension bridge we got going on here. <laughs> oh, what does this guy want? Uh, driving. They they want their own gym. Um, I'll do it. I'll I'll do it. A lot of gymnasiums late later sort of let's see but first i want to make sure well let's see for the classrooms i can just go up but for this yeah i can place that right there and also i forgot to place down a sign because we know we have to have a sign on here and actually signs apparently do help a bit or something i, re I, I really don't know how much they help but apparently they help uh oh it's talking about this that doesn't really matter in fact, let's delete that. Goodbye. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. What, what is this guy saying anyways? Save my property. Build a fire station right now. I'll do it. Yeah, I, I kind of have no choice. Where do I want to put the fire station? Oh, no. So many choices. What do you want to say? Um, and a cup of tea, I f ends up... We have to think about the future. This city is starting to get big and there's only so much space. Well, I'll tell ya. It's freaking small maps. Uh, what happens when, when there's not enough room for people to live in the city anymore? And that we need to consider working towards an ecology. It would be a big undertaking, but it could. And if, But then we could live outside of the region and whatever. Uh, no. And if, uh, the ecology of the... Uh, the uh, <laughs> is uh bas basically is basically um what i was trying to say is the ecology is a great works and we're not going to be doing the great works anytime soon because this is a tourism city and there's no way we could supply the materials needed but yeah okay i am going to make a decision on where i want to put the fire department so yeah another cut because i, I just want i, I want to make this fiend perfect you know want to make, make everything look beautiful okay so one thing I forgot was to put back in the Department of Utilities so I'm going to put it on this side that way I know how much I got to work with because in the future we're just gonna sack these fiends on top of each other so yeah there we go because I, I was like people are protesting that there's too much sewage and it's like why would they I got this but then it's like close need Department of Utilities and it's like oh yeah derp what what did I put down in there what is this? Department of Tourism. Uh, okay. Okay. I guess that that was a bit of an accident. But actually, we do need that for get for the landmarks and stuff that we're gonna place down later on, such as these and so on, like uh, stadiums 
expo center. This, this I definitely want to build. And maybe even this, but wow, that takes up a lot of room. Are you kidding me? Look at, look at this. Look at the size of this thing. Are you kidding me? My goodness. Yay, I finally decided on a place to put my fire station. Now let's unpulse the game. And, oh my goodness, there is a lot of fires around the city. Um, and I actually did t take out a third loan. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and put a bell on there, put a sign over here, put a flagpole over here, because why the heck not? <laughs> but, oh my goodness. Uh, are, are, are all you sims just that stupid that you literally set fire to everything? Oh, wow. Jeez. Oh, wow. Just wow. Well, while buildings are burning, and so I think one, one thing I'm going to do is these roads that go across, I'm going to get rid of some of them and reposition them because... I think there's too many of them for really what we need, and we can fit a few more buildings in here. And I'm always trying my best to make stuff ultra compact. What do you have to say? We're not able to get to all these. We need more fire trucks. Okay, okay. Add more fire trucks. So I've added in a clinic over here, treating 10 patients. Oh, already we're going to need to upgrade this. Uh, not enough simoleons. Oh, isn't that the case with everything? But, yeah, I'm thinking sometime soon we gotta get some, like, gambling houses in here or some sort of tourist attraction. So, let's see. What what kind of options do we got here? Uh, stadiums. I would definitely like to put... Ooh. That, that, that's cool. Max profit. Ooh, I like those numbers. I like this no I like those numbers better though. But then again I gotta get some tourists in here in the first place. But for landmarks, I was thinking, you know what, up on I wanna do something special up on this like hill over here. And what what did you want what what's your problem? Uh yeah. Okay. There we go. Um the sign. Okay, so I want to put some sort of like some sort of landmark on top of this hill. Let's see. Hmm. Maybe leaning tower. That's kind of interesting. Must be plopped on a snap point. We'd have to put something small up here, definitely, because uh, just just because of the train here, it's like we could have multiple things if as long as they're, as they're small, like this. If we find the right place, we might be able to place this or Dutch windmill. Hmm. Oh man, imagine having this all the way up here. Uh, I don't think it would work like that. Oh, it would be so cool if it, we could have it up there. But yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to keep this suspension bridge of derp right here because I, I, I like it. It's just like so derpy, but uh, yeah. Oh, what's going on now? If we get to be a city of 40k people, we'd be considered a medium city. Ready to expand? Become a medium sized city. Yeah, okay, okay, I'll do it. So, wait a minute, did I literally just. Okay, easy money. <laughs> it's like he gave me a challenge and I already completed it. Okay, <laughs> but yeah, let's see. Um, I also did add an incinerator at the garbage dump because I wanted to get rid of all the garbage and destroy this thing and place it someplace else. I don't know where I'll place it, but I want to place it someplace else. Um, how how are we keeping up with the gar garbage as well? Oh, we're not keeping up with the garbage. That should do it. That should do it. But yeah. I'm think I'm thinking like how I got the how I got this bridge over here. I'm thinking I might go ahead and have another one kind of like over here, but then I'd have to knock out some of my residential to get kind of like the the half run runabout or or uh yeah I think that's what it's called. But whatever. Hmm. 
Now I gotta make a decision on what I wanna do next. Well, one thing is crime is definitely, yeah, uh, let's, let's see. Wow, we got crime areas, that's not, that's not good. That's not good. Yeah, we definitely need a police station. So, I should be able to place it right there and still upgrade it. Let me check. No, I can't. Uh, it warned me. It warned me. Boom. Uh, it warned me, but I thought, I thought, you know, it was giving me information on, like, placing the extra jail cells in a different direction or whatever. But anyways, we're gonna need some extra police cars here, definitely. Uh, you know what, I, I can afford it for now. Later on, I'll disable some police cars as soon as we, uh, get some, rid of some of these criminals. And why not an extra jail cell? Because we're probably gonna need it if I had the money! Jeez! <laughs> Oh, it always seems like I'm low on Samoans, and I and I have already taken out all three bonds, so it's just like... Uh, the thing is, I'm, I'm playing with the game paused a lot, which, you know, and, and because I'm doing things that, well, you know, will be bad if I leave the game going all at once and stuff. Is that, is that, oh, right, let's see, can I place this now? Yeah. Okay. Now that that looked weird. Wait a minute, this is all like commercial right here. Wait, what? That's not supposed to be all commercial. Well, I did I did uh, like remove all the roads here and put put them like and, and put them at a new distance apart from each other because I felt like the other roads were a bit too close to each other. But now it's like I, I guess when I did that, it screwed up some of the zoning I have here. What is this? Too much crime. I, I agree, but you shouldn't have abandoned your building. Electricity is short. Oh, no. Oh, no. Call the fire department. Uh, no, that's your job. I'm not gonna call him. It's your job. But anyways, let's see. How how are we doing here? Um, we're not getting everyone, so let's plop down in our Xul bus. And Xul doesn't have enough room for everyone. So... Uh, I hate this. I keep on running out of Samoans. <laughs> okay, there we go. Just got some cash. There we go. And this will still not be enough. So we're going to need another one. And let me guess. Yeah, not enough Samoans. Uh, <laughs> oh, this is so annoying. I go to build or upgrade something. I just keep on not having enough cash. Just so annoying. Okay, there we go. Now what's next? Um, perhaps I should zone more residential. I don't know. Hmm. Let, let me get out like my roads. Let me use dirt roads here. Okay, so that and I want straight roads and that. Okay. So I'm trying to think here. If I have say like another main road going along, like here. Um, hmm. Trying to think. Trying to think. Because if I have, like, an iron road going along here, and then, say, I put an avenue right next to it, like, right, right along there or whatever. Hmm. Yeah, that, that might work out nice. Don't know. Don't know. Okay, so as I was laying out this road, I noticed that apparently we got a water issue and I guess an education issue. Oh, no, that's that's all goes back to water. Okay, and I was thinking, okay, so with this road, we're going to be able to fit two high-density buildings on each side. So that means the buildings will be going right up to here. So I'm thinking maybe I should replace this with a high-density avenue, not a high-density, but an avenue along here. And then I have, like, my utilities on both sides of here. I, I don't know. Where I could have, like, an avenue right here. Hmm. Oh, decisions, decisions. How I make to, how, how I hate, how I make to hate them. <laughs> oh, I am so bad with my words. I am so bad. Oh, boy. 
Okay, so I've made up my mind. I'm going to put an avenue right there. Go ahead and destroy that, and I already got part part of it laid out. So, I'm going to bring this out here. And I'm thinking, let's see, I'm going to go ahead and destroy that road right there. And I'm thinking what I'm going to do here is make this, make this a nice little turn. So I get my curved road. And, um... <laughs> What's going on? Oh, game? Why you no work? <laughs> oh boy, let's try that again. Um, let's use a straight road, like so, and then, ugh. It's like I I don't want it to be crooked, so I'm kind of being finicky about it. Okay. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. Now, now the reason why I want to do a curve, and the, aside from the fact that it looks cool, and, you know, it just, it just looks so nice. And so, <laughs> aside from looking nice, it actually helps with traffic flow, if, and, and over the normal, you know, like, what, whatever kind of curve, like that. Because the traffic has to slow down and go around and here and so on, it's, yeah. Not really all that efficient. So, let's see, in order to, and I actually got cash now because I've been running the game on like full speed whenever I can get the chance. I'm thinking, I'm going to bring this to about here. Now, let me, let me try something. I don't know if I can get this to work. Oh, how does that look? Oh, I like that. I like it. A lot but we might have some problems with fitting a high density building right here hmm that might be a downside but man I, I don't know why but I like using tunnel tunnels in in this game like it, I, I just don't know why but I love using them okay so next I need to go ahead and figure out what my setup here is with let's see get the guidelines that means I'll have a road across there. Actually, I screwed that up because I was not using a straight road and I could tell it was crooked. So let's just use dirt roads for now. Go across right there and get the guidelines. Walk to it then get the guidelines. And mm, actually along this area, I was thinking maybe we could have like kind of like a little road going along somehow like this let's see if I use the like the draw my own road tool nope nope don't do that mm, let's see I, come come on get up get off the guideline <laughs> oh man come on okay I'm gonna just do that and then since these buildings they can never increase density uh, no no. <laughs> that looks so bad. I'm redoing that. That looks so bad. I'm 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 redoing that. There we go, took me a while, and now the road looks a bit derpy, but hopefully that fixes itself when I upgrade it. But anyways, now I got a road that I like. You know, it's kind of like nice right at the bottom of the mountain kind of hillside road. Yeah, I like how that looks. I like how that looks. Now it's time to upgrade it to medium density. Did that work okay? Yeah, no no visual glitches. Good. Because I'd, I'd like to make my city kind of look good. <laughs> Kinda. I mean, it's it's kind of hard with the limited map size, but I'm hoping that the modding community will really uh, go ahead and make a bigger maps mod. And I am out of cash. That is not good. That is not good. Uh... <laughs>
<laughs> Darn it. <laughs> Darn it. I got no cash to build utilities right now. Oops. <laughs> I spent it all on roads. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, well, I placed down some temporary water towers and we got the water situation covered. I connected a temporary road so the power plant would not have any sort of problems. But yeah, I think it's gotten to the point where I'm just going to go ahead, zone this off screen, and rack up some cash because we need some cash to put in utilities over here and so on, such as the sewage treatment plant. I want to put it over here along with the, what is it called? It is called water pumping station. So yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, that's that's all I got to say. There we go. I got the zoning done, and I also, while I was at it, decided to since since I moved a lot of the roads over and so on, I decided to reposition all the school bus stops to make them slightly more efficient in the sense that there's less stops, and you know, of course, added the ones for the new, new road right here with the new residentials and uh, whatever crap that's down there yeah but we do we have been racking up some cash so that's nice that's nice um i'm trying to think what do we want to um trying to think like how should we make this area because i want i want to have a little bit of industrial probably right here just like a little bit of industrial let me let me see would industrial all fit right here um yeah it should um, I don't want, like, the super high-tech industrial buildings, I don't think, because those, those can, can cause, uh, those can have hazmat fires, I think, and those, I'm not, and that, venom requires a, a, uh, large, pol not large police, large fire station in order to deal with it, but I am not feeling like dealing with it, and I've, and I've actually gotten some people who apparently, Raise our land value, please. Yeah, people like that end up living around here. So I'm thinking, you know, we got a little bit of room here. And, you know, with this road and so on. So I'm thinking, you know what? Let's see if we can put a park down. Um, hmm, should we? No, not a tree row. A pond. No, also, we got to check to see what kind of jobs we need. Let's see. Unemployed. Oh, we need medium and a few high wealth jobs. So maybe... Maybe we should put down some really high wealth fancy pants parks or whatever. I don't know. Um, that's slightly too big. That's slightly. That's a bit better. No. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, that works. That works. And now they're increasing in land value and so on. Let's see. If I. You know, I'll just leave that like so. Let me see. Okay, there it is. Land value map. We're going to have to upgrade this park and some more if we want to actually get some high wealth in here. So what what is this? This is small sculpture. Let's put it right there. There we go. We'll get some high wealth in here, hopefully. Also, it's... Mm, the range on this isn't all that much. Well, there, there we got like a high density, high wealth building being built. What, what is it? Is it a, is it? A, oh, it's oh, residential. Good, good. That's good. And wow, look at the look at the cash. We're just making so much. We could probably afford. I well, we could definitely afford to lower taxes. Though I'm a bit greedy, so I'm gonna leave them up there. Let's see. Anything else we should take care of? Um, definitely this. Definitely this. Let, let me go ahead and plan this out or just straight up do it because it's like It's like I I, I want to try and conserve as much space as possible. So hmm Well, there we go. We're done here and uh, by the way and so I I've pretty much filled the, these out for the most part just so that way uh, in the future we don't have like it's already there for us and uh, but uh i did tur turn them off so we got like these fiends turned off wait a minute we don't need that turn it off yeah okay but if we look here and uh, i got uh, like all these other water pumps off and right now there isn't really much water right here but that'll change over time but yeah now that we got that we no longer need this goodbye 
And delete all the roads. Actually, now we may need more sewage over here. I don't know. Ah, uh, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're in the green. And also, I was a bit of an idiot, and I for ends up when I was uh, trying to rack up some cash in it, and uh, didn't put down a garbage dump again. But anyways, there we go. We got a garbage dump. And yeah, they're collecting the city's garbage, which is good because it was getting close to being overflowing. It wasn't overflowing, but it was getting close. It was also causing more buildings to catch on fire because a ton of garbage is a fire hazard. And right now you can see that half the city has got, got its garbage collected for the most part. Actually, I would say more so one third has got it collected. But yeah. Oh, and uh, this road right here I did actually have to move over just by a few pixels in order to fit this all in over here. And don't worry, higher density abilities will go work just fine there and so on. Mass transit. What, what do you do want? Highway traffic congestion. How is the traffic? Right now it's fine. But, uh, yeah. So, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. If you've enjoyed, definitely be sure to nail down that like button. And yeah, I will see you in the next episode of SimCity.